and let's take a look at our headlines. <laughs> Nicole is making me laugh so hard this morning. <laughs> All right. Yeah, lots of shenanigans out here. Cold and sunny out there for today, though. So if you are heading out the door later today, it's going to be clear. High pressure will keep us dry. We're going to see a good amount of sunshine. However, if you're getting last minute shopping done or some of those Christmas errands bundle up, you're going to continue to need that very warm jacket through today. Temperatures will be slightly below average. Now we're tracking the potential too for some snow showers for tomorrow morning. So we might see some light accumulations anywhere from a coating to an inch of snowfall is possible for the morning commute. It's going to be pretty though, I think, and it's not going to be too treacherous at all. And then we've got the chance for an unsettled Christmas weekend. So we're talking about some showers on Saturday for Christmas Day that just will be on and off. We'll see a lot of cloud cover in some spots as well. And then Sunday is a big question mark right now, whether or not we will see a lot of precipitation. All right, right now hearing from our weather watchers. Good morning to John from Basra. 26 degrees out there, 24 degrees in Woolkit. Thanks so much, Dana. Uh, says it's very chilly out there and 26 degrees in Mansfield Center. Thanks, Eric. Temperatures are in the 20s, the 30s along the shoreline. It is a chilly feel, though, with a northwest wind coming in. So look at that. Ugh, that northwest corner feels like it's 12 miles per hour, 14, or 12 miles per hour, 12 degrees, 14 degrees in Putnam, 15 degrees in Windsor Locks. It is a very chilly feel for most portions of our state. And as I was trying to talk about the wind speeds, they're anywhere from 5 to 16 miles per hour, even 17 miles per hour in the Groton area. So it's a definitely very cold feel out there. That snow, once again, anywhere from a coating to one inch by Friday morning, that snowfall is going to move out for the afternoon though. So let's check in on our early warning weather future cast. That's tomorrow's weather today. Heading through the day today, lots of sunshine and clouds will build through the overnight hours. Here's that weak disturbance we've been talking about moving through. So this once again could create just some light accumulating snow. 6 a.m. You're seeing it kind of covering portions of the state. So a little bit of a Christmas Eve dusting to coating of snowfall even an inch of snow is possible for some northern locations. And then as we head towards Friday evening, things clear out a little bit. But Christmas morning right now looking a little soggy and potential for some icy mix as well, some slippery conditions and some portions of the state. Just for the morning, then you can see for the afternoon, maybe a spotty drizzle is all we're expecting to see at this time. So Saturday right now, this model is showing a little bit more rainfall, more rain showers for Saturday afternoon into Sunday evening. And then the day after Christmas right now looks like we will see some breaks, but there's also the potential for some snow showers in the morning and the afternoon looks mostly quiet at the moment. The seven day forecast shows us that, but then you can see as we head towards Monday and Tuesday, uh, temperatures in the upper 30s and also looking at uh, temperatures in the mid 40s for Wednesday. So uh, you could definitely see as we check in on those temperatures. It is going to be pretty seasonal for this time of year. This is usually where we're at in the upper 30s, the low 40s, but the weekend looking just a little bit questionable at the moment.